Well, when I started immunology, really got interested in that. Well, I was interested in subset of immunology, and that's T cells, and there was nothing known about them except they cruised all around your body, you know, and looked for problems and fixed them. And the mechanisms of that just fascinated me, you know. I said, how do they do that? You know, how do they recognize it? How do they get turned on and get turned off and decide what to do and everything? And, and so, you know, we still, in my opinion, only are scratching the surface and understand the complexity of those mechanisms. It used to be that people thought that there were these discrete pathways that T cells differentiate along, you know, when they're stimulated. Now we know, that we're, or we're beginning to see that it's more fluid than that. And that, uh, you know, they can go one way and then maybe become another cell and all this. And uh, it's a dynamic process. And, and uh, if we're going to really you know, use T cells, use immunotherapy. We, we need to understand those sorts of things. We need to understand the impact of epigenetics, you know, the development of different signaling pathways. We need to understand these things in some detail. Particularly, if we're going to start putting these things in combination with with uh, genomically targeted, you know, kinase inhibitors. You know, uh, which which is a you know very powerful way to go, uh, but. You know, we don't know enough about what those things do to the immune system to make any movement there. The thing that we're learning since um, it's become clear in the last three years or so that immunotherapy is the fourth pillar of cancer therapy is that, you know, they're not four silos, you know, surgery, radiation, and chemo are pretty much siloed each into their own and uh, immunotherapy comes along. Immoth immunotherapy is unique and that it can work with those other things. And what we need to now do now is work on a more, um, I don't know what the word is, just a universal way of combining all of these and hope for synergy.